I was born the moment the Traveler died, as everything collapsed around us. Before that day, there had never been a ghost. There had never been a guardian. I don't know much about the Traveler, but I know it made me to bring you back. And I spent a really, really long time searching for you. The Cosmodrome? Not the first place I looked. As I saw the other ghosts find their guardians, and the centuries went by, I wondered if I'd ever find you. And then, I did. I remember everything about the day I was born. I still bear the scars. The Awoken are my family now. And I am their queen. to keep our beautiful creation safe. And now this beast has come, claiming to be king. Marasav bows to no one. You and I know how this ends. We've known since you escaped from that pit. Guide them, my hidden friend. It is all up to you now. Guardian, this is Commander Zavala. 
The Cabal base on Phobos is blasting a signal across all channels. If they're willing to break transmission silence, this could be a prelude to a full-scale assault. We're setting down on Phobos now. I'll be monitoring your feed, Ghost. Good luck to you both. Zavala, we made it to our ship. We're heading home. My contacts near Saturn say the weapon fired only once. It's not like the Queen to attack a superior force. How could she have known? How could anyone? We need a warlock inside the Dreadnought. Here we go. Our first priority must be to protect the city. Our Guardian got a good look on Phobos. Whatever it was, it turned Cabal against Cabal, wiped out their base in minutes. How long would we last? Until we understand what we're dealing with. They... are taken. Eris, get your rock off my map. It hasn't spoken since Crota fell. It speaks now, because Oryx has arrived. Come to fulfill the final covenant of his son. But why fight the Cabal? Not fighting. Taking. Controlling their will. So we focus on his army. Kill these taken until he's all that's left. Whatever you kill, Oryx will replace. The Dreadnought, then. How do we get past that weapon? Without ending up like the Awoken. I gotta go, uh, see about a ship. Kate. Our discussion is not yet concluded. Oh, I know. That's why I'm leaving. visual confirmation. Yep, that's the last one. Port side. Confirmed. Interest in tech, Cade. Isn't this Eris Morn ship? Is it? Huh. You know, you're a true artist. Can't even see the join. <clears throat> Cute. But Zavala's got sign off on all launches. Need to log while I'm letting it go. Stargazing tour? Okay. How about an unsanctioned op using modified stealth tech to infiltrate a dreadnought above Saturn's rings so we can knock out its weapons, create a transmat zone, and send in the cavalry? 
How about test flight? We'll be waiting for you when you're ready. Me? <laughs> oh, I'm not flying that thing. It only took one blast from the Dreadnought. When you're through, it'll never fire again. Just don't forget to plant the transmat links so other Guardians can land. Not everybody's got stealth tech and a ship that smells like hive. Good luck, Guardian. Activating stealth drive. I'm picking up fluctuations in the power conduit. Oh, relax. I modified the tech myself. Probably just Saturn's radio storms running interference. It's malfunctioning. Did you break my stealth drive? You think they can see us? It began with Crota, but Crota was only a servant of his father, sent to extinguish the last of the light. The great battle fought for the soul of our world ended in slaughter. The sun was dead, and we invited the wrath of Oryx, destroyer of light, taker of will. Only Ascendant Hive moves between ruptures. To reach Oryx, you must walk in the dying footsteps of his son. You must become Ascendant. My queen, you were right. The Guardian was the key. For the first time, the whispers are silent. It is done. accepted my fate.
I will not fail. 